They're the heart of our nation. Hi, my name is Clayton Whitney. I manage the Sutina Nation Buffalo Paddock. Five and two, so we've got to do two shots. We rounded up our buffalo herd. We do this every year in, in November. They get vaccinated, dewormed, and ear tags. Oh, it's a good adrenaline rush when you're working with these guys. They're so unpredictable and naturally wild animals, so you just gotta be ready for anything. It's an honor to, to, to be a part of it and really thankful for this herd that we have here. They were dispersed by the government uh, to different reserves from Elk Island National Park. Our reserve got 30 head, 1980. The herd's grown unbelievably since then and got more land for them and they're thriving here. So This buffalo paddocks is actually the center, dead center of, of the reserve here. So like I said, the heart of, heart of the nation. Spiritually, you know, we're connected to them and um, we try to look after them the best we can. Shots are good. Because, you know, the, if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't wouldn't be here today. They looked after our ancestors. So they're a big part of the nation. It's a nice cow, that one. We do a yearly harvest. Last year we harvested 20 bulls for the nation and all that meat gets dispersed out to the elders and people, households could come get so much meat for, for that household. So. Is pretty neat to see. We pretty much covered each household on the nation last year, so that's one of the biggest goals here is to see that meat going out to the members and them eating with the meat that their ancestors ate. Count calf! It's exciting, you know, bringing community members in. They'll be running gates and sorting the bison as they, they come through. <laughs> help and vaccinate and, and tag with me up front. Oh. Baby going straight out. But uh, definitely couldn't do it without these guys here to, to help me do this. Yeah, they got another cow coming too, so. It's nice just to, you know, all, all of us to gather and, and work together, and they really in, enjoy coming here every year to, to do this, so it's kind of highlight and everyone's here. Okay, coming. It's a big weight off the shoulders, that's for sure. Just getting them through and that can take a big breath and it's nice once they're out and see them back in their natural habitat and in their pastures. And it's really um, humbling, I guess, to, to know you're helping the, the buffalo get back, you know, to the land and an animal that was almost extinct, right? And you're a part of that, bringing them back. So yeah, it's, it's a, an honor to be a part of that.